You're watching News 54. The head of the nation President Uhuru Kenyatta has lost his temper after he publicly fumed at his attackers claiming that people should be careful with what they say about his governance. President Uhuru Kenyatta who is reported meeting leaders from various parts of the country at State House, has urged Kenyans to be more keen and strategized with whatever is being said and what can be done. He continued to ask leaders to maintain peace and unity as they proceed with their political campaigns before the general election which is scheduled to take place on August. Leaders and Kenyans at large has dealt a huge blow after the head of state decide to break his silence over the ongoing blames that seem to be attacking his leadership. As he remain with less than six months in the office as the President of the Republic of Kenya, his excellence has been on the front line to ensure that the country is run smoothly in order to achieve the objectives of the nation. Tusitumie hii vita ya corona kama ni wakati wetu wa kupiga siasa duni. Unasikia huko mwingine akisema oh pesa ya corona haitumiwi vizuri ingeitakiwa itumiwe namna hii jameni tusicheze na maisha ya wakenya. Pesa yote ambaye imetumika kupambana na hii jangwa wakati ukifika it shall be audited in broad daylight kila shilingi kila dururu ambayo imetumika wakenya waweze kujua hii pesa ilitumika kwa njia gani na kusaidia nani we shall make it public hakuna kitu ambayo itafichwa lakini hii sio wakati ya kugombanisha hii ni wakati ya kuokoa maisha jameni tafadhali viongozi if you have mercy on your people this is the time for you to be supportive of the efforts that we are all undertaking to ensure that we defeat this virus niseme pia ya kwamba lazima tuangalie mbele tujue ya kwamba corona haitakuwa na na sisi maisha bado tunataka soko zetu zirudi. Jameni nilicheka juzi nikaona wengine wako hapo wakisema uru wafanya makosa atuma maua kwa wazungu. Jameni unajua hayo maua ambayo tumetuma corona itaisha. Hayo maua yaandika wafanyikazi maelfu na maelfu na maelfu ya wakenya. And they say Watu wanakumbukwa wakati wa shida. Tukiwa tumewatuma huko na wanaona hii imetoka Kenya, wakati soko itafunguliwa, mtu akienda kununua maua kitu cha kwanza atafikiria ule alinikumbuka wakati ya shida, huko ndio mimi naenda kununua maua yangu. Think before you start talking nonsense on this social media of yours. We must protect our economy. We must look into the future. We must look at what we are going to do when we survive this is not the time for us to be petty this is not the time for us as kenyans to be cheap this is the time for us to come together this is the time for us to work together this is the time to plan the future of this great land kwa hayo machache na mengi mimi nasema mungu awabariki mungu awalinde tukae manyumbani najua ni ngumu kwa wengi lakini hii ni nafasi yetu ya kujuana tena na mabibi zetu na watoto wetu tukiwa manyumbani eh hey, tusione let us always not look at the negative kuna opportunity ya kujuana sasa tena na ni mema mengi inaweza kutokana kutoka kujuana zaidi kwa hivyo mimi nasema Mungu abariki wa Kenya abariki nchi yetu na endelee kutulinda wakati huu mgumu asanteni sana